what are the square loops first of all we'll discuss about the square loops let us consider the matchbox that is used to lit fire if the match sticks are taken and a square shaped structure is formed then this kind of structure is basically a square loop the same case happens in case of square loop thus we can say that the loops that are basically of square shape and uniform current distribution termed as square loops now let us discuss in detail about the square loops in this the prime thing that we consider is the far fields patterns the square and circular loops of the same area are identical when the loops are small thus we can also say that the properties depend only on the area and that the shape of the loop has no effect when the loop is large now we'll discuss about the pattern of circular loop the pattern of the circular loop of any size is independent of the angle phi but it is a function of theta on the other hand when we talk about the pattern of the large square loop it is a function of both theta and phi let's now consider the large square loop the overall pattern in a plane is taken to be normal to the plane of the loop and parallel to the two sides 1 and 3 this is shown by the line a a dash thus we can conclude that the complete range in the pattern variation as a function of phi is contained in this 45 degrees variation the overall interval is between a a dash and b b dash now we can also cover up by the square loops and their consecutive patterns the related term is